गुड मॉर्निंग एवरी वन माई साफ सूरज यादव असिस्टेंट प्रोफेसर इन कंप्यूटर साइंस डिपार्टमेंट जगन्नाथ यूनिवर्सिटी हेयर टूडे वी आर गोइंग एन इम्पोर्टेंट टॉपिक ऑफ सी प्रोग्रामिंग लूप्स लूप्स इन सी बिफोर स्टार्टिंग दिस टॉपिक वी आर गोइंग टू लर्न वट इज लूप सो लूप इन ए प्रोग्रामिंग आर यूज टू रिपीट ए ब्लॉक ऑफ कोड आइदर ए स्पेसिफाइड नंबर ऑफ टाइम और अनटिल ए पर्टिकुलर कंडीशन इज बींग सेटिस्फाइड इट मीन्स वेन एवर लूप्स वी रिक्वायर्ड ए सम प्रोग्राम ऑफ कोड फॉर ए पर्टिकुलर टाइम ऑफ बींग्स फॉर नंबर ऑफ प्रोग्राम्स एंड नंबर ऑफ रिपीटेशन वी यूज लूप्स इन सी ए लूप स्टेटमेंट अलाउ प्रोग्रामर टू एग्जीक्यूट ए स्टेटमेंट और ग्रुप ऑफ स्टेटमेंट मल्टीपल टाइम विदाउट रिपीटेशन ऑफ कोड वी हैव टू रिपीट नंबर ऑफ टाइम्स पर्टिकुलर कोड टू इन सी प्रोग्राम बाय यूजिंग लूप्स इन सी देर आर थ्री टाइप्स ऑफ लूप स्टेटमेंट्स वाइल लूप डू वाइल लूप एंड फोर लूप्स द वाइल लूप एज यू सी द वाइल एंड वाइल लूप आर द प्री सेट लूप्स एंड द फोर लूप इज द पोस्ट टेस्ट लूप वाइल एंड डू वाइल are the most important loops while is a pre test and uh, do while is post test loops we can use all of them for event controlled and counter controlled loops okay before starting the loops uh, we are uh, know why we need the loops fine so uh, there is a program code in c programming uh, here the, uh, there is a statement that is the hello world we print a hello world in 10 times suppose we are required a situations where we uh, want to print some statement block of code uh, number of times suppose hello world print want to print 10 times then we uh, write to hello world statement in 10 times in our code it means that the code repeatedly 10 time uh, written on uh, language but in looping this is the output uh, hello world the loop is reduce that repeated code of uh, 10 times in one statement we can use loop to reduce this repeatedly code of the repeatedly so start with the first loop types of the loop in c programming there are two types of loops entry control loop and exit control loop entry control in entry control loops the test condition is checked before entering the main body of the loop for loops and while loop is the entry control loop entry control loops are those loops the in which we check the condition before we enter the loop suppose uh, we want to print some uh, code number of times suppose three times we want to check so in uh, pre entry control loops we uh, starting the conditions three times and then the statement of the code is executed while in uh, exit control loop in exit control loops the test condition is evaluated at the end of the loop body the loop body will execute at least once irrespective of the whether the condition is true or false do while loop is exit control loops in exit control loop first we print the statement after the statement we check the conditions so start with uh, there is a loop of programming there is entry and exit control loops uh, this is the for loops syntax this is entry control this is the while loop is also entry control loop exit control loops this is the do while loop where you see the do while loops condition is test after the statements of the all programs now come all the three loops first one is the while loops as you know is the entry control loops the while loop does not depend upon the number of iterations uh, it does not depend how many times we iterate that statement particular statement in a c programming code we use while loop in the while loop the execution is terminated on the basis of the test conditions if the test condition will become false then it will become from the while loop else body will be executed if uh, while loop is terminated and condition is not satisfied the uh, while loop is terminated and rest of the body of the loop is executed in the c statements here the syntax of the while loop uh, in any loop there is three main conditions are there for uh, implementing a loop there is the initialization that is called uh, starting of the loop and second one is the conditions that is the conditions first we initialize a counter after that we uh, check the conditions for the that loop after that update expression it means increment and decrement that counters how many time we repeat that counters so in while loop syntax there as uh, first step we do the initialization of the starting statement 
After that, while. This is the syntax of while. We use while keyword. And in brackets, there are the test conditions. Suppose you have to repeat that while loop in three times in your statement. Then you write while i is less than three. It means the condition is less than three. After that, all the statement that you want to execute in the while loop that is written in that body of the loop. The, all the logic is come under the body of the loop. In body of the loop, the last part is update expression. In mean, uh, it means uh, you uh, increase or decrement the counter value in the last of the loop. Fine. Next, this is the flow chart of the loop. Uh, flow chart is very important to uh, uh, understand how the loop is working. See, uh, while loop start. After that, in preconditions loop, as you, we say, while loop is a precondition loop. So we first step, we test the conditions. So this is the conditions. If condition become true, then execute the body. If, and again, check the conditions. Whenever this condition is being satisfied by the loop, it is iterative. It is become uh, repeatedly execute this particular loop body in the statement. If uh, and conditions, then the, this condition is false, become false, that the loop is terminated. It means the loop is terminated when the condition being false. Else, uh, repeatedly loop is printed the value of the body of the statement. This is the while loop. Here is the example of a while loops. Uh, that code is written in the C language. Uh, this is the main program. First, we initialize expressions that is in i equals to 1. We are initialize a value that i equals to 1. That is the starting condition, starting value of the loop. After that, we second conditions, we check the conditions uh, while i is less than 10. So, we, we check the conditions starting from i and it become i is less than 10. It means i is uh, 9 times we are uh, become the value of i and in body we print the word hello word. And last part, update expressions, it means i plus plus. Every time of i become printed, we become the updation of the counter of i. Suppose uh, when i is starting is 1, we check the condition i is less than 10. It means i 1 is less than 10, it means true. That means first uh, value of the word is hello word is printed of the screen, in output screen. Uh, now take the example of while loops. Uh, is a uh, example of while loop that is written in the C code, C programming language. Uh, the first thing is initialization of expressions. It means we initialize a value of i equals to one. It means the starting conditions. After that, we test the condition while i is less than ten is the condition that uh, meet the body is while of while loop is true. In body, we print the word hello word. How many times we repeat the word hello word, it means i is less than 10. It means i equals to 1 to less than 10. Nine times this hello word is printed on the screens. When i become 10, it means uh, 10 is less than 10 is condition false. The while is terminated and uh, terminal goes to out of the code. And nine times hello word print on the screens. This is the while loop. Okay, uh, this is the situations where we use a multiple statement in while loop. How can we use a multiple statement in while loop? Uh, this is the examples. Uh, in for multiple statement, we can use the braces. For example, this is uh, conditions. If condition is become true, there is number of actions in, in a sequence. Whenever all the, the actions are uh, printed on the screen, this condition become repeatedly uh, print on the screen. When the condition is false, it becomes exit from the loop. This is the code of the uh, this uh, flow chart. We uh, uh, close all the actions in this braces. If we want to multiple statement, we close them in the braces. Now, the second one is the do while loop. As you know, the do while loop is similar to a while loop, but the only difference lies in the do while loop test condition, which is tested at the end of the body. The difference is while and do while is that ki in uh, do while loops, the test condition is being uh, checked after the statement is printed. It means at least one time of your code of statement printed on the screen without checking the conditions. How? This is the syntax of do while loop. 
all three things is there. First is in slications. Then we do start do keywords. We use do keyword and the body of the loop. In the body of the loop, all the statement that you want to print uh, come under the body of the loop. Update expressions and after the braces, we check the condition while expression. In while loop, we check the conditions starting of the loop. Uh, while in do while loop, we check the conditions at the end of the programs. This is the flowchart of the do while loops. Uh, do while loop start, execute body, check conditions true. After that, if condition became true, that is body is printed. If condition became false, do while loop terminate the body. This is the example of do while loop. Same example as we print and on the while loop, we use while loop. The main difference is that Keep, uh, set uh, we value the i equals to 1 uh, and the condition is i is less than 10. In while loop, we put this condition in starting of the loop. So first condition is tested after the body of the while loop will be printed on screens. It means nine time we print the hello world by using while loop. But in do while loop, here you count 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Here is the 10 hello world is there. That is the difference between while and do while loop. Same code, but the condition is that ki, uh, first statement is printed after the condition is tested. It means one extra hello world is printed in do while loop. Suppose again take the example, if we put the value of i is equals to 11. It means if i is equal 11, then first print hello world in one time and 11 is less than 10. That is become the condition false in first conditions. That means we uh, print the statement hello world in a single time. That is the main difference between the lies uh, while and do while loops that uh, single time whenever we want to print a statement uh, before checking the condition, we use the do while loop in our uh, C programmings. This is the main, uh, comparison between while and do while loops. While in while loop, uh, first we condition um, true or false. After the body is printed in do while loop, first we print the statement after the condition is false. It, uh, if condition is false is first statement, then one statement is printed in do while loop. Now come to last loop is for loop. The for, for for loop in C programming is a repetition control structure that allow programmers to write a loop that will be executed a specific number of time. Uh, for loop enables programmer to perform a n number of steps together in a single line. The difference is while, do while and for is that uh, the for uh, check all the three statement in single condition, single, single line of code, single line test all three condition initializations uh, conditions and increment and decrement of counters this is the syntax of the four loops for initialization expression first step after the semicolons then test conditions and update expression in a single line we use all the three basic needs of a loop check in the for loop and after that the body of the loop this is the examples suppose int i equals to 0 i is less than n and i plus plus. It means all the initializations, condition and increment decrement are done in single step in for loop. This is the flow chart of a for loop. Start, initialization counter, condition test. If condition become true, number of block of a statement will be executed on the screen. After that, update expressions. And if the condition again become true, this same task will be repeatedly multiple times. When the condition become false, it, the loop will be terminated. This is the example of four loops. Here is the same examples, hello world. We become the i equals to 10. Here we initialize all three things, initializations, conditions, and increment decrement in a single line. This means the complexity of the for loop is much more uh, less than from the while and do, by, do while loops. This is the hello words. It means this print the i equals to 1 to 10 means 10 time we print the hello words by using for loop. Same example, we will use while loop, do while loop and for loops. Now, what is the difference between the uh, while loop and for loop? 
you see in while loop we check the conditions at the start of the loop after that the body of the loop will be executed while in for loops all the initializations expression and condition subdivisions all will be done in a single line at the start of the loop this is the main basic difference between while and for loops so so students uh, these are the main loop loop loops are uh, c that are the while loop do while loop and for loop we used all loops are done the same things but we we used the loops as per the requirement of the loops we want to use a statement that is uh, required to check the condition first then we use while loop if we want to require a condition check after the loops then we required uh, update uh, use do while loops and the for loop it is the much more uh, easy loop that is all three conditions are done in a single line at the beginning of the loops fine thank you